Good evening, church family and friends. Just want to let you know again, tomorrow, Sunday, March 29th, our worship service will be live again, online only. So we will start at 10.30 sharp. Just want to invite you to gather your family in the living room. If you have a smart TV, watch us on TV or on a computer or on your phone and worship together with us in that way. Also, when you do your tune in, put a comment underneath it and just let us know that you're there. Uh, like it, share it. Uh, it really blesses us to know that, that you are there and you are worshiping with us, even though we can't see uh, you in person. I know you will see me on, online, but uh, just, just do that. It really encourages us and blesses us. I mean, we would love to just gather here at the building and worship and fellowship what we're used to. But in this time, we're going to do the best that we can and, and spread it out. You know, the word of God says faith comes by hearing and hearing the word of God. And we want people to hear the word of God. They need, to, they need encouragement. They need to be blessed. They need to learn to trust God more. And I, folks, I'm excited for tomorrow. Our worship team uh, has already done a great job to prepare us in singing tomorrow. I am going to first share with you a little bit of a history to help us understand a little bit better why we do what we do during this time where this coronavirus is spreading. And also, uh, I'm just going to have an opening and a prayer. Now, we will have worship, singing, and then after that, I'm going to share God's word with you. And I am very excited for the word of God tomorrow. And I truly trust and believe and pray that the Holy Spirit will encourage you and bless you and give you wisdom and will help you to understand so that you can apply it like he did for me as I studied and as I prepared. Originally, I was going to preach my last message this Sunday on our series that we were in, The Power of Love, but already uh, before this week, I just felt in my heart that the Holy Spirit telling me that I needed to preach something that was in our time, that we could relate to today in the things that we're going through. So thank you, folks. Uh, we are so blessed through what you do. And uh, keep it up. And you know, folks, this will also pass. And one day we will gather again here in our facilities and we will love each other and we will worship together as a group. And I can't wait for that day. But in the meantime, we're going to make the best out of it and praise God that he will be glorified, that he will be honored. See you tomorrow morning.